He was the losing pitcher in Philadelphia last Wednesday night, but he beat the Dodgers in L.A. earlier this month. Yeah. Called strike three. Jerry Lane rings him up on a fastball off the plate. It's the right-hander Ross Stripling. Ten appearances this year, but all coming out of the bullpen. Along the right field line, Verdugo drifting toward foul ground. And he's got it. And a nice look from our director, Brian Moss, at that Granky curveball. He gets Peterson for his third strikeout. They came through. Look at him. Right back up the box. Ahmed behind the bag. That one almost got Granky. Apparently didn't realize Nick was cheating up the middle of the field. Right to it. Way in. He got on that one. It's gone. Number seven, one nothing, D backs. They tried to come in there on the pitch before, and AJ pulled it foul. They go right back in there again. This time he pulls his hands in a little bit closer to his body and is able to keep it fair out into the bullpen in left field. Another start at third base for the injured Jake Lamb. He shoots this one the other way. Peterson in left. And it's over his head. Daniel Descalso, his fourth double. Good start to the D-back second inning. Shoots it the other way. It's a fair ball. Here comes Descalso. Here's the throw. It's way offline. Ahmed into second, and it's 2 0 Diamondbacks. Look to drive the ball early in the count, and with two strikes, just hit what you see, and that time a little breaking ball up and out over the plate. Base hit. RBI single for Granke, and it's 3 0 D backs. Just rips it to the left side of the infield. No chance down there for Max Muncy as that one rolls through for an RBI base hit. He's got five hits in his last three games. And he goes around on that one. Five strikeouts for Granke. AJ takes off. Grandal's throw. Got him. Taylor able to apply the tag. He drives this one toward the pool in right center, and that's going to reach the wall. Now it's Monty Grandal. That's double number eight on the year, the first hit for Los Angeles. Down, and it gets between his legs to the backstop, and that run scores. Well, the next time you call for that pitch. Oh, my goodness. Ooh. This is hit well. Deep center field, and it's gone. Nick Ahmed onto the home run porch. That's number five, and it's four nothing. As you were saying, Bob, this is not the same Nick Ahmed at the plate that we've seen the last few seasons. Yeah, not at all. I mean, if you saw Nick play the last couple of years and, and then saw him this year, you might have trouble identifying him at the plate. And he gives one a ride. Deep right field. Verdugo won't get it. It bounces into the seats. Mathis will have to stay put at third. It's a double for Granke. He's two for two. For what looked like a routine fly ball, this one has squared up to the gap in right center, chasing Verdugo back to the 376 mark. He gets all twisted around. This is trying to get to the seats, but it won't make it. Muncie's underneath. Launches another one. There it goes. A.J. Pollock. His second home run tonight. That's number eight. And it's 5 nothing D-backs. And Bob Renley, you know what that means. Yes, I do. It's time for tacos. Oh, A.J. has hit the ball hard. That was a slider that just stayed in the middle of the plate and down. It's underneath it. Golf shit to left field. Didn't even look like a home run swing, but he barreled it up and got it way out of here to left field. Nick bangs one into left. That gets down. Peterson over to cut it off. 
Descalso's in at third, and Ahmed has a double. He's a triple shy of the cycle. Taylor hits one hard toward the left field corner. That gets down and reaches the wall. Chris Taylor, the Dodgers shortstop, leads off the sixth inning. Just the second base hit for L.A. against Zach Greinke. Hit hard and through. Taylor being waved home. Dyson's got it. No throw. And he's 5-1. Dodgers on the board. Yeah, he really is. Yasmani Grandal having a nice year. Was hitting 291 coming into play tonight. That's his second base hit in the ball game. Fastball down and away. Bellinger. He belts this one fair down the right field line. Grandal headed for third, and they're going to send him in. Diamondbacks can't control the relay, and Peterson's all the way at third. Well, for Yasmani Grandal to score from first base, you know things had to get a little bit sloppy. That ball's hooked down into the right field corner for Gerard Dyson. And they hit off the edge of the bullpen right there, got away from him momentarily. His throw back to the infield clanks off the glove. Got him. Ten strikeouts for Zach Greinke. Muncy launches one toward the right field corner. And it's in the bullpen. Max Muncy, his second of the year. And it's a 5-3 ball game. Literally just hung up on that inside part of the plate, didn't get down low enough, wasn't away far enough, and Muncie just keeps it inside the foul pole down that right field line for a solo homer. Those hands got out over the plate, the baseball found it. Off the glove of Singrani, deflects it to Taylor at shortstop, high throw, and Dyson collides with Bellinger. He deflected off Singrani. Taylor got to it with the backhand, the long throw, pulls Bellinger off, and then his body's colliding over there at first base. Mathis scored from third to make it 7-3. We'll check to see if Dyson is okay. That's belted down the line and fair. It's headed for the corner. Dyson picks it up out there. Center field Pollock backing up near the track. Barnes coming home with a fourth Dodger run. Grandal moves up to third. That's a base hit. Grandal scores at 7-5. Matt Kemp showing a much quicker swing this season than we've seen for a while from him. That was a really good battling at bat against a guy that has plus plus stuff out there on the mound. Fouled off a lot of mid 90s fastballs, fouled off a curveball, and then ultimately drives a fastball up the middle for an RBI hit. AJ belts one to center field. It's gone. His first career three home run game. AJ Pollock. You get the feeling if he had 10 at bats in this game, he'd hit eight home runs. Just barreled it up out in front of home plate. A fastball from Josh Fields. That went right out the tunnel up there. In the air, right center field. Ball game. There it is. Box them up. <laughs> Brad Boxberger gets the save. The D-backs get the win. And after losing yesterday in Washington, D.C., they win here. And for the first time in franchise history, the D-backs have gone a calendar month without losing back-to-back -back games.